state and local officials, and all my friends and family here today. Thank you so much for being here on this special day. When I look out and see the size of this crowd, I am truly amazed and honored. For those of you that I pulled out off the street and agreed to pay so that it would look like we had a good crowd, <laughs> please see me after the program to collect your money. <laughs> First of all, I do want to express my deepest appreciation to you, Governor Haslam, for giving me this incredible opportunity to serve as one of only five members on the Tennessee Supreme Court. I also am truly humbled to be the first person to receive two judicial appointments from you. Many people believe, myself included, that a governor's greatest legacy is the judicial appointees that he leaves behind. In just your first term of office, you have truly established a track record of impeccable judicial appointments. I am honored to be a part of this group of appointees. Also, Governor, I pledge to you as well as to all of my family, friends, and colleagues here today that I will always conduct myself in a manner that will make you proud and provide a good legacy for you, from work ethic to quality of work to exemplifying the highest of ethical and moral standards, I will work tirelessly to excel in each of these areas. I also want to express my appreciation here today and to acknowledge both former Governor Don Sundquist and former Governor Phil Bredesen. I was honored to have the appointment of Governor Sundquist in 1999 to the trial bench. I was then appointed again to the trial bench by Governor Bredesen in 2005. I likely would not be in this position today without the 